Hi YouTube, it's Catherine here and this is week four of my carnivore journey. Um, this marks the one month mark. So um, I feel a lot better now um, in terms of digestion um, and I think my electrolytes are starting to sort themselves out. I'm still being really mindful about it and I'm still um, supplementing, which I will probably continue for quite some time. But uh, weight wise, I was up two ounces. So um, I will insert the, um, I have like a calendar of my whole weight loss. Um, so I'll insert that <clears throat> just so you can see um, exactly how I fluctuate. Uh, so, sorry, cats. Um, overall, I would say I'm not really losing weight at this point. He's gonna hit it again. And, um, sorry. Uh, I did start some or try some Swiss cheese um, the last couple of days and I've definitely noticed that um, my weight is fluctuating up. I'm not very happy about that but the Swiss cheese is delicious. Um, so that brings me to a total weight loss of 3.2 pounds for uh, one month of carnivore. Which isn't a long time, so I'm just trying to just chill, be with it. I was, I never lost a single pound on vegan for the last year, so I think I'm just antsy to start losing again. So um, I have that in my mind, and we'll see. Uh, digestion, um, I no longer have diarrhea. Um, I went about eight days with no bowel movement at all, and I've gone more consistently since then. So we'll see how that goes. But if you are on carnivore and you go eight days, don't start freaking out. As long as you feel okay. My understanding is, is as long as you're feeling okay and you're not feeling constipated, then everything is a-okay. So that's what I was going with. Um, other symptoms, let me just check. I don't think I've had very many. Um, my face is doing something weird over here. I, it's really hard to see, but there's like these little bumps. Uh, they're not pimples. I had these bumps the entire time that I was keto. Uh, or not the entire time, but a large chunk of the time. But overall, I would say my skin is doing pretty well. Um, I'm not having any um, like pimples or breakouts in that way. Um, even on my chest and my back, whereas like I was getting a lot, I have nothing right now. So I do have these, um, whatever's happening over here, I guess we'll chalk it up to detox. Something is trying to come through my skin. I don't, I don't know. They're just bumps. Um, they're red. They don't really itch. They don't itch. They don't hurt. They nothing. So, um, and there's none on this side. This is the same side though. I had these little bumps right here by my ear forever. I don't know. Um, I have nothing else happening, which is, I guess, good. Like I have no pain, which I didn't really start with pain. Um, I've been sleeping really good, um, getting a, a full night's sleep every night. Um, I'm hardly getting up to pee. Uh, maybe once if any um, and usually it's like you know by the early hours of the morning like it's usually like three or four in the morning so um, nothing like before like I was getting up like three to four times a night to pee and that's a lot that's a lot of disrupt disrupted sleep um, other than that just keeping up with the uh, sole water so sodium and um, Magnesium spray on my legs. I'm way less consistent with that as well. And um, also going to be, um, I'm doing potassium. I'm not doing that as often, um, which I might kick myself for, but we'll see. It just tastes so gross. It's the no salt version and ugh, 
I do like an eighth of a teaspoon and like a shot of water and I just shoot it down and it is just so disgusting. Um, I'm still eating, uh, I'll try to do maybe a, uh, a day, a day of uh, my eating and just show you how much I'm eating. Um, I'm roughly eating probably two pounds of meat, one and a half pounds of meat maybe. Uh, probably two and with the cheese and oh, I've been snacking with pork rinds and cheese I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing but for right now it's fine I'm coming up on my cycle so I'm not sure as well if that's why I'm a little bit more snacky I've definitely even noticed more cravings coming and I'm not sure if that's because of my cycle or if that's because of the cheese <laughs> So I'll have to definitely be mindful about that. I'm not having um, hardly any anxiety at all. Like, none, which is lovely. So, um, you, you know, there's still day-to-day -day stuff. I still have day-to-day -day moments, but um, it's really low grade. Like it's not anything like it was. Um, and I might try some other dairy products to just see if they are affecting me or not affecting me. So that's where I'm at. Um, maybe I'll take some composition pictures. Um, I do have some, but most of them are pretty like no clothing. Um, so we'll see if I want to share those. Um, that's my update just trying to think if there was anything else but I don't think there is thank you for watching and I will see you guys next week hopefully with a weight loss let's hope that starts to tread in that direction um, see you next week <laughs>